Hey everyone, I just want to take some time here to highlight various resources that are found on the new e-learning support site. So in this one, we're going to take a look at a resource called Big Blue Button. So what Big Blue Button is, uh, it's well essentially kind of like a virtual whiteboard. Uh, you can use it to annotate uh, on a plain whiteboard, or you can add images and annotate over those. You can actually record your session and you can also generate a link so for others who would like to join your session such as students they could do that live and you could be explaining something uh, or you could record the session and uh, share that link later on so under the e-learning support site it will bring you to this new website developed by the department of education and under the how to tutorials you will click on there and you'll have a link to a bunch of uh, resources that are uh, great for teachers to use uh, and supporting their students in this time. And scrolling down, I'm coming down here to where under virtual meetings, I'll see here it says log in to big blue button. So you can log in uh, with your Google credentials. I'm already logged in, as you can see up here. And I have a room, I have recordings that I've sort of played around with before. And so I might just go in and start a session right now. Now there's lots of tools in here, lots of different things you can do. I won't go through all of them, but I just sort of wanted to highlight a few things and bring these uh, to your attention. So once you get uh, connected here, uh, thank you. And uh, in here you'll see, uh, you sort of have your virtual whiteboard here. You can uh, make it full screen if you want to, zoom in, do a few different things. You notice it says slide one, so it could go over multiple slides if you, whatever you're presenting or creating, uh, needed some new screens along the way. Up top here, you I could start recording this session. Well, like I said, I could record this and then uh, share that link out later, uh, or post in Google Classroom, however you uh, communicate with your students. Uh, over on the right here, you do have a few tools. So clicking that tool, uh, you can get sort of your pencil, your drawing, you can draw shapes. Um, there's lines you can draw, insert text, so if, uh, quite a few options. Uh, you can undo things if you make a mistake, delete, uh, and uh, turn on the multi-user whiteboard. So uh, down on the bottom, I'll click that away there, a few other tools here. You can have a calculator pop up. There's an equation editor, so if you're doing some things in math that require that, that's always a good one. And then down here, you do have a plus sign of some other things you can do. So you can start a poll. You can upload a presentation. So if you had a, a slide deck or of some sort you want to bring up, and you can share an external video. So if you did want to put a video in there uh, as part of your presentation, you have that option as well. So I just wanted to sort of highlight uh, this tool that's there. Um, and in case you weren't aware, and uh, it's available for all of us to use. So feel free to have a look and maybe it might serve some needs uh, for you and your students.